Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome to this week's episode of Q to the top, season four, episode, four, season three, episode four, season four, episode four. So, so, anyways, okay, last episode ended with we saw him, <clears throat> saw Hinata, you know, Hinata Shoyo from the concrete, you know what I'm saying? My boy, my mo my boys, um, learned learned the split step, um, and then um, we came to realize that his other, his ball boy partner gave him a thumbs up, and my man's got ball tapped, literally. Well, not a ball tap. He got he got ball. Ball slammed. That's what happened. Um, that that actually that part was actually so funny, dude. I didn't not expect that shit. But anyways, um, this episode is gonna be a good one because I don't know what we're gonna do this time. Uh, this episode's called Take It Easy. I don't know about that one. I don't know what we're gonna do here. Um, uh, what's gonna happen? But um, uh, either way, I just can't wait to um see Hinata grow a little bit more. So that being said, guys, um, let's just get started. Hinata Shoyo from the concrete. Oh yeah, that's right. Tsukishima asked him to go to follow him somewhere. Oh. Tsukishima's all like, yeah, I want my boy. That's my guy. Ah. Damn, that's what they're eating over there? That's a five-star course meal, bro. Oh, hell nah. Broccoli number one. And two. <laughs> that's true. They, they do have the, that um, stupid hairstyle, bro. I always have that. Oh, it's a sick guy. Uh, dude, this guy definitely has coronavirus. Oh, hell no. Nah. How did you manage that? Oh, this guy must be a really good, like, defensive back then, I guess. That's what he's asking about receiving and stopping Ushiwaka. He called his ass normal as hell. He's like, yo, you're normal as hell, boy. Stop being a minor character, man. One of the top three in Japan. Especially him. Who's him? Oh, him. What is that? Is he an ace? Is he a setter? Like, what is he, bro? I see Joe has been a bit different ever since we played Karasuno. He feels threatened by, by Hinata probably. Unforgettable face. What's the face that he made? After he did that sh Ooh, I remember that point. Oh, that was such a good... Ah, oh, that was so good. He obviously seen those set, but what was the face? Ew, why does those oysters look so bad? Yikes. Looks so weird. Wait a minute. I feel like, I feel like, um, Washijo Sensei was maybe smiling. Like had a little grin. <laughs> Do I actually look like a libero? No, it's because he's small. <laughs> if you're gonna smite, I'm gonna stuff it right back in your face. They just want to go block his ass. I believe it's my turn now. <laughs> the straight. Am I the shortest now? <laughs> he's so cocky, but I love him, dude. Oh, it's like it's like a it's like a jab fake. He Loki does want want well, I mean, to spike the ball a little bit, give him a little bit. But I think he's actually really just trying to try to block. He really just wants to learn how to block. Oh, we're getting more, a lot more of, um, damn. We're getting a lot more Tsukishima. Tsukishima and, um, Kageyama. Which is good. Because those guys actually got selected. I like Mr. Hinata over here. <laughs> more compact than Zippy. Oh, he's an ace. Whoa. Oh, it's vertical, that's why. Whoa. Damn! He did the thing where it, like, curves it like this. You know what I'm saying? The animation was weird. I would see why people would think it's bad. But at the same time, it looks weird, but it looks very, like, looks real. You know what I mean? I don't know, in a sense. It looks very, uh... I don't know. I don't know the word. I'm asking you if you've seen any of my games before. <laughs> Kageyama always has that same face when he looks at this guy. Usually people underestimate me because of my height. Oh, he's gonna be one of them. He's like, I'm guessing he's like a little bit taller version of Hinata. He said you're a great reference too. <laughs> you're goody two shoes on the court. He called him a goody two shoes. Oh, he's doing that mind games on Kageyama. Oh, hell no. Nah. Mr. Chicken Hinata. How do you do? The Hinata eyes. <laughs> Our Hinata's gonna get that bird's eye view again. We watched him play. Or maybe he just doesn't want to move. Kunimi Akira. Least favorite phrase. Go all out. <laughs> Kunimi is the uh, Shikamaru type beat. What does it mean by taking it easy? He learned something off of that one. The one who has it the hardest. That guy over there. He has the least experience. So why is he, was he invited there in the first place? 
Oh, I get Kunimi. He's like, um... Kunimi's like a, uh... He's like the dude from Neko Nekoma. Seems like his team has more time, huh? His feeling of being left further and further behind. Can't wait for this 2 on 2 to hurry up and be over. That feeling, I've, I've seen that before. I've seen that feeling before. He said, I wish you were the one invited here instead of me. Damn. That's, he's not wrong, but Hinata will say something different. Say, hey now. Say, well, Kageyama, I'm a little, uh... What do you mean, just? Well, being tall is not a talent, but, like, it's a gift. Said, Lutz, I mean, what? I want to beat you. So he told him, I'll make you happy so I can beat your ass later on, boy. Hinata's different, dog. He wants him to try something. I wonder what that is. Let's take it easy. Ah, I see. It's a, uh, it's like a, it's the, um, it's nerves, pretty much for him. So if he takes it easy a little bit, you know what I'm saying? He'll be able to, you know, that, it, that's, um, that's contagious, bro. Like, if you play, like, 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 just calm and collected, your other, your teammates will be calm and collected with you. That's what they're trying to get at right there. You're kidding me, you're me, like, oh, hell no. Nah. That's too easy. That's too easy. Man, you know, about to fuck around and get this guy drafted onto a Karasuno, bro. <laughs> about to trade his ass. Or he could just leave a free agency, you know what I'm saying? What's Kageyama afraid of? What's happening here? Is it that face? Ah, so I'm guessing we get a little bit more Kageyama next episode. Okay. This outro hard, man. Oh, Kyoko Chan, bro. Kyoko Chan. That, that, this shit right here is funny as hell. Because pretty much what he's telling him, he's all like, I want you to get better. So once we meet and play, I will beat your ass at your full potential. That's a mama mentality type of beat, dog. Recipes Kobe, by again, by, again, by the way, dude. My idol. All right. So um, I just want to say, man, like, good episode. Good episode. Um, take it easy. That's also a very, very important thing with sports, dude. Just taking it easy goes a long way. Like, not really taking it easy, right? You don't want to, like, like, you know, just, like, ease up when you're playing, playing a sport. Obviously, a competitive sport. But taking it easy means, like, being calm and collected. If you be calm and collected, everything will come to you. You know what I mean? That's, that's just how it works. And it's contagious, too. Especially in a team sport. I know, I know how this works. I know how this works. It's good. It's good to see. It's good to see this kind of thing. And uh, this is like kind of one of the lessons that like a lot of people don't understand. Like a lot of people who don't play sports just don't understand. Like you don't have to be like on edge all the time, you know. Obviously, there's times where you could be. It's okay to be on edge. In those very crucial moments, the best thing you can do is be calm and collected. You know what I mean? But with a little bit of poise. You know what I mean? So I thought this episode taught like pretty good, pretty well. I feel like people are complaining about the animation, especially with that white-haired dude um, at the All All Japan camp. I mean, yeah, it looked weird, but, like, I knew immediately, like, I, I saw Naruto vs. Pain Fire. I thought that shit was wonderful, but, like, animation was, like, it was kind of weird or unorthodox. That's what this is. That's what this, the, the new um, style of animation is, like, unorthodox. But I like it still. So people will be complaining, probably going to be complaining. So I'm just going to be here, like, you know what? It's still good. I still think the quality is amazing for this anime. So, no, that's pretty much it. Um, next week, I don't know what's going to happen. We're probably going to get more Kageyama at the All Japan camp. Um, and yeah, uh, that's all I pretty much got, I think. So, hey man, um, I appreciate everyone, um, coming to this video. I love y'all. My Twitch, Twitter, Discord, I'm right here. Those links are going to be in the description below. I highly recommend joining Discord because my boys are joining Discord. Discord's popping nowadays with these new people in Discord. And it's fun. Like, I want my community to be more tight knit, you know what I mean? I want everyone included. So, I think Discord is the best way. Um, that or the Twitter. I'm trying to get more active on Twitter, and I am active on Twitter a lot. I like being a keyboard warrior sometimes. So, and I also give updates on like the channel, like what videos go up and stuff like that. And yeah, it lets you guys know too. Um, if you like the video, give a like, come subscribe. Subscribe button is gonna be right there. Best video for you to watch is gonna be right there. And then the most recent video that I post on my channel is gonna be right down there. So, with that being said, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.